artists are really inspired by diverse things, I tell you. Sometimes it's amazing to know what brings out that creative juice in them. Our artist for this week already had that gift. He sculpted his first piece at the age of 10 under the watchful eyes of his father. Born in 1928 in Ilarogo in Oshu State, Southwest Nigeria, master sculptor George Arowogo took Lamidi Fakeye under his wings in 1949 for more tutelage after he was trained by his father. In 1955, he went to work at Holy Cross Primary School in Lagos as an art instructor. Lamidi's first solo exhibition was in 1960 and took place at the British Council in Nigeria. In 1962, he was named the artist in residence at Western Michigan University in Kalamazoo, Michigan. By 1964, he was elected president of the Society of Professional Artists of Nigeria the same year that his exhibit opened at the United States Information Service in Nigeria. And in 1971, there was an exhibit that showed three generations of Fakaya woodcarvers in Ibadan, Nigeria. He was appointed to the faculty of the University of Ife in 1978. He served as the artist in residence at a number of universities abroad in 1989. Fakir's work appears in many private collections as well as the permanent collections of institutions such as the Indianapolis Museum of Art and the John F. Kennedy Center for Performing Arts. He died in Ilefe Alshu State on December 25, 2009. Yes, Professor Lamidi Fakeye is our artist for this week. We decided to tell you more about him because when we featured his brother last week, that's busy, a lot of people were asking me who Lamidi was, so I felt it was necessary to give you details about him. So let's tell you as well what to look forward to when you tune in next week. Next week on Art House. Synergy by Gabriel Udoka at the Vivid Art Gallery, Lagos. A lot of things I like documenting things via drawing, via painting, I like seeing people and drawing them. I, the happiness that I get in the process of drawing someone's face, even right from my childhood, the happiness is what I like. Then the UN Nations Information Center shows the works of art done by students from various secondary schools about using arts for sustainable development. All that and more when you tune in next week on Art House. You can enjoy Art House on any of these platforms. We'll be showing you that and more when you tune in next week. And always remember, you can see this edition wherever you are in the world on our YouTube page, forward slash channels web, and then write at house on the search icon. You'll see all our videos just for your viewing pleasure. I'm Melinda Akinlami. Have a lovely day.